My wife and I uh, started the business in 1977. Uh, I had worked for another contractor prior to that. Pretty much ran their business for a few years and decided that I could run my own. And uh, so we mortgaged our house and uh, took a big step. You know, we had a good reputation, so we, we grew. The demand grew greater. I hired employees. Um, but then in about 1986, we had grown to a point where I was working 20 hours a day. I hired a consultant to come in and help me because um, I, I was probably going to have a heart attack. It was just working too hard. He followed me around for a week and then he, he met us later and said, you, can, you have a decision to make. You can either get bigger and I can help you be profitable in that or you need to get smaller so that you don't kill yourself and I can help you be profitable in that. So uh, I was pretty energetic at that time and I said, I'll take the bigger. So as it turns out, that same year, uh, my brother and my brother-in-law approached me about coming to work for us. And at that point, I hired them. My brother and brother-in-law still work here 28 years later. Uh, my two sons have joined us um, about 15 years ago. And uh, we have a couple nieces and nephews that work for us. And within our company, there are seven family units. So either a father, son, or two brothers, husband, wife, work here. You know, we have people that all have the same thing in mind, to give our customers a great value and a great product. If you think about it, I mean, if you had a stone driveway, I can make it blacktop. If, if we have a field, I can make a, a running track and a football field or a tennis court. And, um, you know, we do more than just pave the planet. We, we create a surface that, that makes your life better. I, I do have a, a succession plan, and um, we started talking about it 12 years ago. I announced that someday I would retire within 10 years, and here lately I've, I've got that to three. I've named the next president uh, as one of my sons. So we're all kind of gearing into fitting him for the job and adjusting everyone else to his leadership. In, in the United States, a, a family business could be, just be a husband and wife, and, it, and that's as far as it need, need go. Um, but there are values that are shared beyond business practice, and, and I think that's what our country needs more of, really. You know, I, I owe a lot of our success to the Family Business Center, and, you know, the guidance and direction, the peer groups, the, I belong to the CEO group. There's so many uh, things that that I've gained from that organization that, uh, you know, I don't know where you'd go and buy it. So I, I appreciate their, them being here and I celebrate their 20 years.